This is Azgur Demirtas. I'm a professor of finance. I lived in the U.S. for about 15 years where I did my Ph.D. and I was also a finance professor as well. And then I moved back to my home country, Turkey, for about 10 years ago. Right now I'm a chair professor of finance, but that's not my only role. I also uh, am a consultant for various companies, not only in the finance sector, but also in the real sector. And on top of that, I established a center of excellence in finance within the university. And uh, I am also a board member of one of the largest private banks in Turkey. And uh, I do these keynote speeches as well. But what are the topics that I specialize on? What are the things that I love to talk about? Let's see them now. Machine learning, artificial intelligence, and deep AI. They may seem similar, but they're different. There are specific differences between those three things. What are they? And why are they important? How is it going to change the lives of companies, both in real sector and in financial sector? Can an AI predict the future better than a human being? You know, as humans, we have something called sixth sense. We have something called intuition, and we really rely on that intuition. Super smart people have great intuition, as you know. But just recently, something happened. Even the smartest person got beaten by AI, deep AI. This would have happened anyhow. We know the time would come and it already came. So what is next? We know that AI is superior. We know that they predict better. We know that that piece of code will beat us in our best games going to the future. But what should companies do? What should individuals do? What should white collar workers do? What's gonna happen next? What are the risks and what are the rewards? That is the thing that I talk about in my speeches regarding AI, regarding deep AI, and regarding machine learning. Applications of machine learning, we already know that deep AI can beat the best of us in our best games. It's already done. So now the question is, how can we use the risks and rewards, or how can we identify the risks uh, regarding deep AI and the rewards of using that? What should companies do? What should white-collar workers do? How can we use machine learning in basically finance sector? How can we use machine learning in textile sector? How can we use machine learning in supply chain management? The companies who use them, who know how to use them, will definitely be better in the future. And the companies who resist change, as it always happened, will cease to exist. And here I am to talk about the risks and rewards of machine learning, artificial intelligence, and deep AI.